Hello everyone, uh, welcome to my channel. Uh, so today I want to show you uh, how to uh, check if your Linux computer was hacked or not. And generally just uh, some li little bit about uh, geeky stuff. So, um, okay, so we're gonna explore a uh, command called netstat. Uh, it also can be used on Windows command line and in also in Linux. So uh, what you want to do is um, open up your terminal. I'll make it a full screen. Type clear. So what you want to do is type net stat uh, dash a. So that will bring all the uh, processes that you're you're running. Uh, so you see uh, here you get like all this. Uh, uh, this is a Unix process, but um, let's see if we can get at the top of the page. We can't. So obviously there's a lot of processes. So what you can do is just type net stat and type all, and then uh, pipe it to more. So that way you can scroll it down with your enter enter button. A bit slowish. But uh, yeah, so you can see, you can see here, um, you can see what you want to look for actually uh, is uh, these uh, established connections. This is established connections with the server, so you don't know what they are. So what you want to do, so you see, don't worry about listen and all that. But uh, yeah, so uh, you can scroll down. There's a lot of stuff here. You can. Center. You can also look for them here as well, but this uh, Unix, um, this is a Unix uh, processes, uh, as you can see, sockets, active Unix domain sockets, service and establish. You can al also look for them here, but uh, it shouldn't be any any here anyway. So we're only looking for foreign service, like at like the top we saw here, here service, uh, service and established internet connection, active internet connection. So what we want to do is look for hackers here. So don't worry about this, uh, but we still have to scroll it down. We can actually cancel, but you can look for them here as well, but I don't think there should be anything in particular there uh, established. But if you find it, then, uh, then yeah, then something wrong with the system. Uh, you, with your, your system was, uh, yeah, it might be might have been hacked off the network anyway so clear that and so what you want to do uh, like I said you want to look for established connections so you want to type is net stat this time net stat and you want to put dash a a and p so that will display the as you can see oops sorry um, Mistake net stat a a p and we want to pipe this to more. Okay, now you have uh, not now it says not all processes. What does it say? Uh, not all processes could be identified. None. Blah blah blah. So now you're looking here. You get a program program ID. So what this p does? Besides the displaying all, we just displaying uh, process ID and program name. So you can see here it says foreign processes. So we're looking. Don't worry about this. Just established. Okay, established. That's what you want to look for. So it's Skype. So this is obviously you know it's my program. I have a Skype actually open at the moment. So uh, it's established now. I'm not sure what this is, but this is closed uh, now. Uh, I don't see any more established connections. Uh, maybe Firefox, but I don't see it anywhere here that it says it's established. Uh, so yeah, so you can scroll down and have a look at some more. So just seeing there's nothing here, nothing here. You can see this all all says connected, but don't worry about that. Uh, what you want to look for established. So there's nothing more. Uh, I don't think there's anything more here to be uh, noticed. But if you have a foreign connection, it would say uh, where the 
where it's located and what host w which server it's connected to and it would tell it will tell you that it's established so the connection uh, will say again we'll just type in again net stat a b more more okay so oh, it says you have to be root to see all and I don't know that anyway yeah, so here we have uh, yeah some local host. I'm not sure why it's not saying anything here, but I have a uh, Steam open and Skype. But this is what we're looking for: establish Skype, Skype. So it's all okay. okay. It's all okay because I have a uh, open Skype connection. Uh, Skype, is, Skype is open and it's connected. Uh, yeah. So uh, yeah. So I don't see anything else here. That. Uh, but what you wanna do is uh, look for some strange connections like like here for example you will have some either server name or server server address or something and then you will uh, look for which what's the what's the name of the process and if you find the process let's say there's some foreign process here instead of Skype it would be some some names do some dude's name or something or some strange name uh, which you don't know obviously you, you know it's not you uh, who's opened you all you need to do is just um, so all you need to do is just type top and find the process name here you will find the process so you see you here you get like all the root processes see, see you have some processes but what you want to do is find find uh, uh, the, the process ID for that the process it was displayed before so you'll find that you can find the process by process ID and then you look at here and, and have a look what the process is so you can scroll down all the way to the end and then find what's the strange process is there and then you can just kill it uh, so that will uh, just you just type kill kill minus nine and then process ID whatever it might be uh, so let's say two zero uh, five seven six something like that so yeah that will should get rid of that can kill that connection of the present so anyway thanks thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to exit so uh, yeah thanks for watching and I hope you like this video and uh, yeah uh, stay tuned